Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, as you'll have seen from the title, I'm doing a H&M haul. I have never, I don't think, done a H&M haul on this channel before. I find them really hit and miss. Like sometimes I'll go in there and I could literally like rummage all day. I find loads. And then most of the time I find absolutely nothing. But it's one of those ones, I see people wearing things and I'm like, oh, where's that from? And they're like, H&M. And I'm like, where did you find that? So they must have good bits all the time. I'm just obviously not going to the right stores or something. I don't know. But yeah, I did find a lot of nice stuff on their website. So it's going to be quite a big haul. So I'm going to try and whiz through this as quickly as possible for you guys. If you have been here before, then you would have noticed I'm using a different backdrop. We are refurbishing the flat at the minute. So I'm kind of moving around to the rooms that don't have the most mess. So yeah, bear with me. Also guys, if you haven't already checked out my latest Primark haul, I am doing a giveaway in that. So I will leave a card for that up here. So head over and check that out once you've watched this video, of course. And the giveaway is to win a £30 Primark gift voucher. So I will leave it up here, as I say. Really easy to enter. And I also have another Primark haul coming your way probably Tuesday. So yeah, stay tuned for that. But yeah, without further ado, let's just jump straight on into this video. Okay, so the first item I'm going to show you is this denim play suit. I really like this. It is probably a little bit shorter than I'd feel comfortable in going out. But the actual denim quality and stuff does actually feel really nice. And I really love the wash of this denim. It's a really nice baby blue sort of colour. Fits me really nicely. I will leave all of my sizes and the pricing on the screen down here. But this one is a size 12. I know that because I just looked at it. I think it was quite reasonably priced, but I will double check and leave the price down here for you guys. But yeah, really soft. It doesn't have pockets, which is a little bit annoying because if you've been here before, I just love a pocket in an outfit. I feel like I need pockets, so why do you not have them? But other than that, I think it is quite flattering on the figure. Obviously, you can sort of cinch your waist in and it was quite easy to get on as well. I was a little bit concerned that it wasn't going to go over my hips, but... The zip literally goes all the way down to here. So yeah, really easy to get on. Okay, this next dress I'm hoping isn't see-through. It doesn't feel like it's going to be see-through, but I have black underwear on. So if you can see that, then excuse that. But I really love this. So it's kind of like just above the knee midi mini dress. I'm just going to pan you guys down so you can see the length better now. Okay, so this is the length of the dress. As you can see, it's just above my knee. Sorry, I've had to cut my head off. But yeah, this angle, I need to figure out my angles basically. This is what we're working with at the minute. But yeah, I really like the length of this dress. It's really comfortable. I love how floaty and flowy it is especially for the hot days that we've got coming up this is going to be perfect you're not going to feel like it's clinging to you or anything like that yeah it's going to be really comfortable in the heat so i believe they did actually do this dress in black as well so if white's not really your color then maybe check it out in black as well it does have adjustable straps which i just find so handy because obviously we're all different heights and stuff so you could make it a little bit shorter or a little bit longer if you needed to um, you can maybe chuck on a belt with this. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down below. I do think it's cute. I'm just not sure on the length because it's just above the knee. I'd rather stuff like this be like a midi length or a mini. It's kind of just like an awkward in-between length. But the material and the style of the dress I do actually really like. Hopefully you guys can see if I come up close. The material is like a crinkly, almost like cheesecloth sort of material so it is a really nice quality i'm just not 100 percent sure on the length so let me know what you guys think down below because yeah i'm kind of 50 50 on this one okay guys the so next thing i have to show you is this nude play suit and i think this is such a casual like comfy vibe this is the sort of thing i would wear in the day if you're on holiday when you go to get like your breakfast or your lunch or whatever or on the hot days we went to have in england this is perfect just to throw on but you still kind of look cute hopefully you guys can see if i come closer up the material is just more of like a nude jersey ribbed fabric yeah so really easy to chuck on also i really love that it's got like a fastener here so you can do it up there so it's not really low cut which i like but you could have it undone if you wanted to i personally don't think i would i think i would feel a bit conscious that i was going to come out of it but yeah i really like the fit of this i love that you've got the tie belt so you can cinch yourself in because Although it's casual and it's a bit looser, it's nice to have like some shape around the waist. The length is actually quite good as well, to be fair. I'm around five foot seven. So if you guys are around my height and you struggle with things like this being too short, then I'd actually say this is a really good option. I don't feel uncomfortable in this at all. I would go out in the day or on holiday and feel absolutely fine with this. I just thought I'd quickly show you guys what it's like undone. So as you can see, it is a lot more low cut and I didn't think I would like it, but I kind of think it just makes it look a little bit more dressy. So if you just put like some body oil on or like some shimmer, some gold jewellery, I definitely think you'd need like boob tape with this because 
I do think I'd fall out if I was like bending over and stuff too much but I actually do like it like that a lot more than I thought I would or you could actually wear like a bralette or something underneath okay this next dress I like but I, I'm not 100% sure you guys will have to let me know what you think of this down below so I saw this on their website and they did actually do this in different colors like the stripes were all different colors so I think they were sold out on the other side I went for the yellow stripe it's a kind of it's like a lemon and white stripe but it is a really thin material and it is quite see-through like you guys can probably see i've got black bottoms on and you can see it through but i feel like you could definitely wear this as like a beach dress maybe even like a bikini cover up you know again if you're going to get your food like in an all-inclusive hotel or something i feel like it would be perfect to chuck on but i do see a lot of girls rocking these in the summer with like some sliders or some slip-on loafers and they do look really cute so let me know what you guys think down below. I'm not 100% sure if it suits me. Like it just doesn't really do much for me where it is so loose. I think I'm just used to having things coming in at the waist here. You could have it done up here, but to be honest, I just probably wouldn't. No, I wouldn't do that. <laughs> I would just leave it undone. I think maybe though I would have been better off maybe sizing down a couple so it wasn't as saggy, if you know what I mean. Even though it's meant to be the style, I just don't know if it 100% suits me when it's like that so yeah definitely let me know what you guys think down below because i'm really undecided on this one okay guys so although this is probably the simplest piece i think this has got to be my favorite i absolutely love the fit of this so it is a bit more of a relaxed fit but you do have this like drawstring in the middle to really cinch your waist in hopefully you guys can see that and also it does have that detail again where you can make it not as low up top or you can have it a little bit looser if you wanted to so have the button undone it's just a little bit lower but it's still not really low like it's definitely wearable like that again maybe put a little bralette or something underneath to dress it up a little bit if you wanted to but for a daytime look i absolutely love this i think as i say it's got to be my favorite it's got pockets which i'm here for i don't know why i love a pocket so much but i'm very partial to a pocket yeah i'm just really a fan of this the straps as well are just tie up so you can have them as loose or as tight as you want to and i'm really pleasantly surprised again with the length when i looked at this on the hanger i wasn't sure if it was going to be too short but it's perfect it covers my bum nicely but again if you are shorter or taller than me then i feel like you'd be absolutely fine because of the fact that you can tie these tighter if you wanted to or looser it kind of gives you a little bit more length or less length if you know what i mean really happy with this one i think this one is definitely going to be staying because as i say i just love having things like this to chuck on in the day when i know it's going to be hot i want to be comfy um but still looks good so yeah i would just literally chuck this on with maybe some gladiator sandals or something i think would look really cute okay guys this top i'm pretty sure i got this in the sale but hopefully i can still find it for you guys because i did have it in a couple of colors so it is like a thin knit material so i really feel held in obviously i don't have a bra on i don't really feel like you could get away with one in this maybe a strapless bra i'm not 100 sure but i just really like this i think it's so flattering i love the color i love this sort of nude tone with a tan i couldn't resist when i saw this i absolutely love it i think it was really reasonably priced as well okay and i actually just checked i got this top for five pounds like i am so happy with that the quality of this five pounds worth it 100 so yeah gonna be keeping it really like this they did do it in black and white so hopefully i can at least find one of the colors for you guys as i say though it was in sale so hopefully it's still on there um yeah if it's not linked down below then i couldn't find it but i do really like it and i love just having basic little crops like this to chuck on with different jeans or shorts and with the weather we've got coming up i know i keep saying it but i'm really a summer kind of girl this is going to be perfect so okay this denim skirt guys i really didn't want to like it because i've just bought one from primark and i've taken the tags out of that so i'm keeping that one but i'd already done this order from h&m and i really love this the only thing is i feel like you need to size down in this i went up to a size 12 but i'm really between sizes and it's massive on me here it is a really nice like stretchy denim material so it's really comfy but i feel like it just makes it come up a little bit bigger so bear that in mind if you are going to order this but with the detail and the stuff on it i do really like it's got these rips but it's not too much they're more of just like frayed rips which i really love I love the wash of it and as i say it's just so comfy like i don't feel like i'm wearing denim so yeah i love having denim when it's comfy because there's nothing worse than it being hot and being in a really like tough rigid denim so really a fan of this girls can't recommend this enough so if you are on the hunt for a denim skirt then check out h&m okay so i've got this little outfit on i'm gonna start with the top excuse if my hair is just getting messier and messier i don't know why i always choose to have my hair up when i do hauls because i literally look like i've been dragged through multiple bushes by the end of it 
but this crop top i do like it i just thought i was gonna like it a lot more than i do i think it's the sleeves i think it just looks a little bit frumpy maybe i don't know i don't think it's see for anything like it is quite good quality material i just think it's kind of a bit frumpy the reason i fell in love with this top first of all is because it's got this open back with this like tie detail which i thought could be really nice in the summer obviously this is just easy to chuck on with some denim shorts or something i don't know if it's what i what i've got it on with or it is the top itself there's just something about it i think maybe it's the length of the sleeves they're quite an awkward length like normally sleeves like that are more of a cap sort of sleeve and then more voluminous yeah i don't really feel like this is doing anything for me but some of you guys might like this especially if you're the type of person who doesn't like their arms and i feel like this could be a great option but for me i just feel like it's cutting me off in all the wrong places to be honest i don't think it's the most flattering and then moving on to these shorts again i just feel like they're kind of cutting me wrong i think they're just a little bit too long on me like they're kind of cutting me off at an awkward point on my leg I don't think they're the most flattering. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think down below because I've really been on the hunt for a pair of shorts like this. Just some that are a little bit more dressier than like denim shorts or cycling shorts because I tend to lean to those a lot in the summer. So I wanted some like this, but I don't think these are the ones that I'm going to be keeping. I think it's just the length I'm not sure on because it's a shame actually. The quality and stuff is really, really nice. And it does have this like tie belt here to sort of pull in your waist. And they do fit really nicely. I did pick these up in a size 12. They fit me nicely on the legs. I just do think they're a little bit too long. And they have pockets, so that would have been a winner as well. But yeah, I just don't think they're the most flattering on me. But if you guys did want some longer shorts, and again, some that are a little bit smarter, then these might be ideal for you. Okay, you know what I've got this top on with? But again, I'm just not 100% sure on this. I do really like the concept of it. I just don't know if it suits me. I don't know. Maybe with a little belt around the middle, I think could look quite cute. Because it's got this kind of like peplumy thing going on the bottom of it and i do really like the color i just don't know there's something about it i'm not sure again if you guys could let me know down below whether i should send this back or keep it that'd be really helpful um i feel like as well to be 100 percent honest this would be an absolute pain to try and iron unless you guys have got a steamer like where would you even start with this there's so many ruffles like are they meant to be ruffles is there meant to be ruffles within the ruffles i'm just not sure so yeah I don't feel like this is for me. This isn't like an easy chuck on top. This is, I need to know that I'm wearing it two hours before so that I can iron it type of top. And that's just, that's just not me. I like the colour. I feel like this would look absolutely stunning on a lot of people. But for me, I just know that I wouldn't reach in my wardrobe to grab this a lot. So I feel like I will be sending this back. But the fit and stuff is really nice. I did pick this one up in a size 10. Um, and it fits me perfectly. And also, in case you're wondering, there is a zip on the side because it is like a non-stretchy cotton material so yeah really easy to get into with the zip and stuff i just don't think it's for me so last but not least i have this really cute black top now i actually didn't think i would like this as much as i do and um, you could also wear this on the shoulder but it is quite big like it's quite a dramatic sleeve can you guys see that but i do kind of like it like i am kind of into these dramatic sleeves at the minute so i'm not gonna say i don't like it because i do and the quality of this is lovely so basically the body of it is a really nice stretchy cotton material and then the top is more of a structured sort of cotton material so it holds its shape but yeah i actually like this the more i'm wearing it is growing on me but there is a disney villain who wears like a cape like this or something i can't remember who it is if i can remember i'll put a picture of it here but it's really giving me those vibes but i do think i like it and i know that they did do this in white as well so if black isn't really your color then yeah i will link it down below in white as well the main reason i picked this top up is so i could sort of dress up an everyday outfit so if i wanted to just wear denim shorts i could pop this on and some nice sandals and make it a little bit more dressy but i'm not sure how much use i would get out of it although i do really like it it's not really one of those tops that you could wear over and over again and someone wouldn't notice that you're wearing the same top, if you know what I mean. Um, not that there's anything wrong with that. I just know what I'm like. I won't use something like 10, 15, 20 times if it's really recognisable. Okay, guys, that's everything that I have to show you in this H&M haul. I really hope you did enjoy it. Again, like I said at the beginning of the video, this was really hit and miss for me. I do probably like half of it and half of it is 100% going back. Like, I'm not a fan. But I can appreciate it's nice quality and it would suit a lot of other people. It's just not really my vibe so yeah a bit of a mixed feeling on h&m but i did pick up some really lovely bits as well so i will be keeping those if you guys did enjoy this then please give it a big thumbs up and make sure you are subscribed i've got lots of giveaways coming up and another primark haul coming this week and then lots of other hauls actually i've got a lot to film so i better get doing that 
But yeah, I really hope you guys did enjoy this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys.